Hey guys, Ryan here um, with the Montgomery Homestead, and today I just um, want to show you guys um, what we've been doing on the farm. Uh, we haven't really talked about the chickens recently or posted at all, um, but we've been busy and we've been doing stuff. Um, so as you can see behind me is a chicken tractor that we built. Um, pretty simple build, it wasn't that hard, um, but the chickens have been in there for a couple weeks now, um, and it's been working out. We've been moving it around. Um, every so often uh, just to give them new grass under it but we, recently we've been letting them out during the day uh, just so they can have grass in our fenced in uh, yard um, so they've been in here for a while um, but we're hoping to let them out um, in the farm uh, with an electric fence um, around them to protect them from cutters and stuff and yeah so they've been doing pretty good they've been they've grown a lot they are super big now like they've grown up so much in the past two months <laughs> yeah they've been eating a lot uh, we got a new type of feeder um, which I'll show you so here we have our water um, I think it's about three gallons maybe and then we also have this feeder right here, a two. Um, yeah, so th the tractor, um, it's a eight by three feet, um, so it's a lot of room for them. Um, we may build another one uh, when they grow older. Um, yeah, uh, right now we just have a tarp roof, um, chicken wire for the, for the sides, um, and yeah. Uh, in a couple months, they'll be laying eggs, so we need to add nesting boxes to the back um, over there. Um, next to our chicken tractor is our new dog, Gracie. Um, we got her a couple weeks ago. She's like two, almost three months old, I think, and she's like the guardian. Uh, she's a paramis, which hopefully when she gets older, she'll be uh, protecting the chickens and pigs. And um, yeah, so... She's just, just been hanging out with the chickens. So this is about the size of our yard that they've been in. They've just been roaming around. Um, we haven't had any. Well, we had them escape, but they haven't gone far. They love to go under uh, the, the deck. And they also love to go on the stairs. Um, and just stay here. Good chicken. Um, we're hoping to get a perimeter fence at some point and yeah We want our dog to be able to go around everywhere make sure like there's no predators protecting our pigs and our chickens and hopefully soon rabbits and goats um, Yeah, so I want to go to the uh, Where our pigs are which uh, if you saw our last video um, I showed you our pigs and we got them a couple weeks ago um, And yeah, and I also want to talk about like our plan for everything because uh, last video you saw what we did, but you didn't even see like how we did it or at all. So I, um, I want to talk about that more. Um, so yeah, here's our pigs. They've dug up way more than last time. They just keep digging and digging. And it also rained a bunch the other day. So it's pretty muddy back here. Um, but yeah, so this is our pig port. Um, we also have another pen over here. So what we did... Um, is before what we had is the main frame we had um, these posts right here um, that one um, and then we had that's basically it we just had the post on each side and we had that post and that post um, and those around but what we did is we added pallets just random pallets we got um, from a random store or just dumpsters and they work they have worked out great I mean we just screwed them together screwed them to the post we had already and we've also dug up um, and put in some posts to make it more stable around like this that that wall is not stable at all but it's it's worked out I mean it may not be the nicest but it works and that that's all that matters uh, so, like I said, this is where the pigs are. 
we seriously need to put some more wood chips on. Um, but here's more our storage area. We have a bunch of tools and we have feed right here. We have feed in here and here's some more, uh, I think that's, uh, wood shavings. Um, but we have wood chips and we got a lot from a friend, uh, and we have just random stuff, ladder, and some more posts over here. Um, and you may be wondering, are we going to keep it like this? No, we want to have goats in here. Yeah, so we want to have goats in here. And what we want to do is we want to add make add pallets and make the wall taller so they can't just jump out. Because goats, like, they can escape from any fence you build. Um, so we want to make sure this is fortified. Um, and we're probably gonna have to get rid of all this stuff, put it in the shed, and, yeah, I mean, I think we've, like, we've literally been living in this house for, what is it now, three months? Three months at the most. And we've already had pigs, chickens, we may get goats soon, um, my mom said we could get rabbits once we get the two animals we have settled. Um, and with rabbits, I really want to do taxidermy i've been wanting to do that for a long while so yeah but we've done a lot but we have a long way to come we have to get our chickens settled have another electric fence um to have them in um we want to be able to move the pigs around everywhere well guys thank you so much for watching this video um and i just want to thank you guys so much for subscribing if you have already um but if you haven't make sure to subscribe we are at 44 subscribers from the last time I checked, and we, uh, and we are growing fast. So I want to make a goal of us getting the 300 subscribers by the end of the year. Um, I know it may seem a lot, but I think we can do it easily. Um, so if you haven't, make sure to subscribe. Uh, make sure to like and share this video with friends and family. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Um, be expecting more uploads and be expecting more vlogs like this.